I know when I made The Godfather, I had no power at all. I had a wife, I had two kids, and she was pregnant. And I and I loved, loved my kids, I loved my wife, and I had to support them. So I, I didn't want to do The Godfather, but I did the job. I, I took it, I had to. Then everything changed. But what I did is I became very Machiavellian. In other words, I had, I tricked them into letting me have Brando. I tricked them. So in a sense, I turned into Michael Corleone. And I was that kind of Machiavellian guy, just like Michael was as he takes over. Yeah. Then later I found myself in the movie you saw. I was in the Philippines. I had millions of dollars worth of helicopters. They were fighting a war, so the helicopters would all be gone. I was in an impossible situation. So I turned into a megalomania. I turned into curse. And I'm beginning to realize that I always became the character of the movie I was working on because I had to. I even, and this is weird, I'll never understand, I was making a movie about a man who loses his son and I lost my son. I'm saying, what is this? Do I, do I have to, is this my life or is this basically all the movies I'm making is my life? I mean, when that happened, of course, that's not something I can see why I became like Kurtz because I had to. Yeah. yeah, you know, but but I didn't have to lose my son. Yeah, but the movie was about a guy who loses his son. I'm not sure I understand my life. My life might all be a, 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 a Charlie Kaufman movie. Yeah, yeah, is how I yeah, how I feel.